What is going on guys, DBG here, and in this video we are going to be doing an all Sapphire squad. So this team is actually fairly good, and hopefully we can go and get a win in my team online with the team of all Sapphires. These guys are all extremely, extremely cheap, so now let's get on to the team. At the one, we have got Sapphire OKC Thunder James Harden. This card is better than the other Sapphire because he's got an open shot 3 of 81, the other one has 70 something, he's always got the great release, he's got 91 ball control as well, and it's just that little bit better than the other. At the two, we have got Sapphire Peja Stojakovic, the 6 foot 9 shooting guard who's averaging 5.7 points per game for me, two gold badges which is good, very good for Sapphire to be fair, and he does have an open shot 3 of 92. At the three, we have got the second Sapphire I ever got in my team, and it's Sapphire Shane Battier. Honestly, I played only 16 games with this guy, and he's only averaged two points per game. Not a great card, to be honest, but still not bad. 85 shot three, but he doesn't have the best release, but still not a bad card by any means. At the four, we have got Anthony Davis. This card is a beast. Still is a beast, especially with that duo with Jamal Mashburn, who's quite cheap. But a good mid-range shot, an open shot 3 of 71, meaning he can hit them from the corners. At the start of this game, this card was honestly one of the best cards you could get. Almost as good as a ruby, honestly not that much worse than his ruby, and just a beast of a card. And at the 5, we have got Sapphire Mark Gasol. This card again is almost as good as a ruby. Open shot 3 of 84, which is huge, and I pretty much perfected his release by now. His overall game isn't as good, only a 77 post fadeaway, and his rebounding is okay with a 69 block, so nothing on the diamond, but still a great card. Off the bench of the point, we have got Sapphire Lance Stevenson. This card is really nice. Like, he's got an open shot mid of 81, open shot 3 of 84. He's also got 87 ball control, meaning he can speed boost. And just overall a good card. And because he's 6'5 and has a better jump shot, is why I have him in over my backup point guard. At the 2, you know he has to be in here. It is Sapphire Reggie Lewis. Yes, Sapphire Reggie Lewis. Open shot mid of 84, open shot 3 of 76. Basically the exact same card as the Ruby, almost the exact same stats, just doesn't have the hot zones and doesn't have the badges. At the three, we have got Sapphire Rick Fox. This card is really good. Like 89 defense overall, he's getting a nice release and 84 on shot three. But look at his defense stats, 86 on ball defense, that's really good. So he's definitely, definitely a good card to use in this game. At the four, we have got Sapphire Larry Johnson. This card is actually really nice. He's still got the nice release of Larry Johnson. Open shot 3 of 78, which is not bad. He's not obviously anywhere near as good as a diamond. But a driving number 77 is not terrible. And this card is quite good and very well rounded. At the 5, we have got Nikola Jokic. This card, again, just like Marc Gasol, has an 84 open shot 3. And they're honestly very similar. I prefer Marc Gasol because he's a little bit taller. But they're very similar, these two cards. So, rounding out the bench, we have got Stephen Curry. His card, he does have like a 90 ball control and 90 open shot three, so we gotta have him in here just in case we need to put up some threes. We've got Gheorghe Mirasan, who's seven foot seven, and he's also got fairly decent-ish stats, decent free throw, good rebounding, good block, so a good card to have. And the last player off the bench, we've got Sapphire Robert Ori. With that Hall of Fame catch and shoot, I don't like this card too much, as you can see from only shooting like less than 40% from three with him. But at the same time, if we need some jump shots, you get a good shot three with that Hall of Fame badge, and he might bail us out a few times. So now let's take a look at the entire squad. Okay, so let's see what his team is looking like. Okay, way, way better than us, but it's not the best. Kevin Johnson's good, Unsell's good, Marion's good, but I think we have a shot. He's off balling, so you know what I'm doing? I'm five out. Screw it. There's no point in me not doing it. He's off balling, so. Jump, get him jumping. Don't miss the open layup, James Harden. Come on. I'm actually so used to playing with Diamond Harden that I expect him to do the exact same things. His ratings are way lower. Full white bar. And James Harden nails that. Let's go. Diakovic wide open. A little bit short. That's Diakovic nails the three. Let's go. Two point lead. Use two false screens. Three false screens. Hit Marcus off for three. What's it up? Contested. And that's short. Come on. Get back there. Cover on south. Double, double, double. Good defense, James Harden. Pass it up. Pass it up. Okay. Oh, damn. Go to basket hard. Baddy in the corner. Put it up. And Baddy hits a three. Let's go. Okay, like, this thing, it's much... Like, the shots that you'd be taking with diamond players is much, like, 
you just take, I'm just taking bad shots because I'm so used to Diamond players being able to hit them. But like, I'm one Reggie Lewis. It doesn't matter what version of Edgy, Reggie Lewis you use, he's still the GOAT in this game. Hey, he's running that Stevenson. He's too fast, he's too fast. In the corner, Larry Johnson puts it up. And he puts it in. Bad shot. Okay, so we got an 8 point lead at the end of the first. We played some great defense with that team, but our offense was poor. Pull up. A little bit long. A little bit late. Oh, damn. Alright. So I know I still have a 7 point lead, but the game's starting to feel like it's more drifting into his favor. Like, I had a much better first quarter than him. Like, it seems like it's starting to... He's getting a little bit of momentum. So we gotta put an end to that. A three here would be nice. Or even a mid-range will do. Let's go, Nicky. Or let's go, uh, Larry Johnson. Nine point lead. Okay, we got Curry checked into the game. But Curry's gonna be on skates trying to guy Kevin Johnson. We do have Mirasan in there who's just gonna swat everything that comes in there. And how the hell did Robert Ori not steal that pass, though? Let's go. Reggie Lewis in the corner, puts it up, and he puts it in. Let's go to GOAT Reggie Lewis making a double edged game again. Okay, I got 2.6 seconds to put the ball up. It's going up with Steph Curry. And I got a full court to shoot the ball. Charge, damn. Hoping for the block. Oh my god, that shot went in. That shot went in. Wow. Oh, damn. Okay, he's not going to take me inside with Dwight. Why do I ever talk? Every time I say something like that, it backfires. Pull up, Curry. Please hit a jump shot. Let's go, Curry. 10 point game. Let's steal Robert Ori. Let's push it. Get to Curry from mid. On the line. And Curry hits that. Let's go. Let's get Curry hot. Robert Ori, Hall of Fame catch and shoot. And he nails the three. Let's go. This is now a 15 point game. Like he's off ball, so the best way to get open and off ball is a pick and roll. And he leaves his all open in the corner. You can't leave your solo in the corner. Not with me, anyway. I have his release pretty much perfected. Green light. With defense, Anthony Davis. Get the Harden. If only it's Harden at Hall of Fame Dimer, but I don't exa know exactly how much that badge does. Jam that. Let's go, Gasol. Easy dunk. That's just too easy for James Harden. You're just letting him walk through the middle. Okay. What way are they going to try to defend Harden? Good pass. Marcus on the corner. Puts it up. And he puts it in. Let's go. It's a 16-point game now. I think this is our biggest lead of the game. Okay, we need to stop here. Don't let him get momentum. Do not let him get momentum. Because if you let the better team get any momentum, they are going to win the game in the end. I learned that the hard way from KOK. Coldy's Warrior Squad killed me in the fourth quarter. If you let the better team get momentum, it's over. But you just stop, stop it. You slow the game down, and you just play. Get him up. Easy for Marcus off. Damn. All right, he's at the line. Okay, he's off balling on Peja. Let's just bring Peja up for the pick and roll. See if he knows how to defend this. Which he doesn't. Let's go. Finish the lap. There we go. Like, he's off balling on my shooting guard, so I'm just going to run pick and roll point guard to shooting guard. Right, defense, Rick Fox. Let's push it. Let's push it. Let's push it. Throw it up. To Reggie Lewis, apparently. And Reggie Lewis is the GOAT. He makes that. Doesn't matter what version of Reggie Lewis. All Reggie Lewis's are the GOATs. It's a terrible shot. That's an absolutely terrible shot. That's too late as well. Why didn't he just give it to Ben Wallace for the open layup? It's fine. He has... Okay, that's finally... He, he, he hasn't hit a shot all game with Wes Unselt. So I'll gladly take that. Like, if he's missing shots from him, I'll gladly take him taking shots with Unselt. That's just no defense at all. Like, no wonder he's playing off-ball defense, because he can't play any on-ball. It's a great shot there from Marion. This is an 11-point game. This could actually be a ball game. Yeah, like, he gets the next score, it's a ball game. Take him up. There we go, lay that in. Let's go, James Hart. Okay, off-ball and Peja. Pick and rolling using Peja. Abuse, abuse the fact that he doesn't actually know how to play defense in this game. Pull up Peja Stiakovic. Green light. Let's go. That's a massive, massive shot. 14 point game. Surely has the dagger. Pull up. That's contested. It doesn't matter. Peja Stiakovic hits the shot anyway. D 
defense bad. Yeah, it's like his third block now on um, Marion. Okay, that's open. That's open for Stiakovic, who hits the three-point shot. 19-point game. And that is the game. We win it by 19 in the end. So let's have a look at the team comparison. We shot 58% compared to his 52. He only shot 29% from three, which is probably the difference between the two teams in the end. And um, we got 11 steals compared to his three and eight blocks compared to his zero. So overall, we just had a much better game, much more well-rounded game. So let's look at the box score now. Peja Stojakovic had 13 points and most of them were in the fourth quarter, only missing one shot. Reggie Lewis at 12. I didn't shoot two out Reggie Lewis, but I was taking like stupid shots with him. So anyway, that's the video. This pretty much shows you can still win a game. You mightn't do too well, but you can still win a little bit with Sapphire's MIT team online. So anyway, that's the video. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.